All right, so Dr. Sean and Dr. Jeremy here with The Active Life. Uh, we're here to talk to you guys about shoulder health with your athletes. The first test that we're going to be doing is when an athlete walks into the gym, before putting a barbell over their head, before having them kip on the bar, we want to make sure that they can actually get through a full range of motion with their shoulders. So we're going to start off with the athlete lying here nice and flat with the knees in a bent position. Jeremy's going to take his left arm. With his elbow straight, he's going to bring his arm all the way over his head until his index finger touches the floor with the elbow still straight. Then he's going to bring that arm back. Now he's going to do the same thing on his right side. Perfect. Now he's gonna bring both of his arms down, both arms at the same time. Great. If your athlete can do that and pass, we're gonna bring both those arms down. Jeremy's gonna go ahead and flatten out his legs, which lengthens out his hip flexors. And now we're gonna go ahead and try again. Left arm is good. Right arm is good. And both arms are good. What you're looking for with an athlete here is that any one of these tests, right? The arms, Jeremy, go ahead and show them a fail on the left side. So Jeremy's arm is just a little bit off the ground, right? Whether he's feeling pain or not is indifferent. He's not getting through a full range of motion, right? He could reach for it, go ahead, reach for it, arch your back to get there. If you're seeing this with an athlete, you're gonna see that form emulated when they have a barbell going over their head, and it's something that we need to address. It'll be covered in the content.